Welcome to our channel, Sailing Until Valhalla. This is Anthony, my fix anything mouthy captain, and our three crazy kids, Dean, Lance, and Rose. And I'm Stephanie, the one who makes the videos, wrangles the kids in while helping run the boat. Come along with us on our journey of exploring the world full time on a hardened 45 sailboat chasing the next adventure. Okay, it is like coming up to 7 a.m. this morning. We have been in Port McNeil now for like a week, um, which was a little longer than we planned, but the weather had other plans. <laughs> but we are headed to Port Alexander today to stage to cross for Cape Caution tomorrow. So um, this looks like our only window for the next, for a while. Um, if we don't do it tomorrow, then we won't have another one open up probably for over a week. So it's gonna be a bit sporty when we go uh, to Port Alexander, but it will be worth it to be able to cross and get Cape Caution over with. We are both a little nervous because we've never taken this boat on the ocean. So, um, and Cape Caution is known for being bad. So, but this is looking like the window. So we'll video our trip up getting there and then we'll do Cape Caution tomorrow. Yay. And then we'll finally be in the inside passage. <laughs> this boat it's not anything but we still don't like doing that uh, but this is the only way that we can get this window so we're hoping that it's not as bad as they think they put the storm down uh, from what we saw yesterday it looks like it's better than they thought so fingers crossed After waiting for two hours in that anchorage, we decided it was time to just turn back and go back to Port McNeil, but we did have all of the sea state right on our nose, so we kept getting pitched up really far up in the air the whole entire time. It took hours to get back, and we were going extremely slow. 
Queen Charlotte Strait has definitely been our least favorite one so far to go through. Okay, I don't know, I don't remember when I last updated, but we basically are still in Port McNeil right now, and um, we tried to go out to Port Alexander to stage for Cape Caution because there was like a one day window. Um, it was way too bad out there, we had to turn back because uh, we were just, the boat could have done it, but everyone was really uncomfortable and Lance got seasick and puked everywhere and so we decided to turn back and just wait for another window because it was only a one day window and it wasn't supposed to be that bad out there. It was like almost 30 knots of wind. It was not predicted to be that much. And so we didn't really trust even going on the next day for Cape Caution either because if it was that much just in there, we couldn't even imagine what it was like on the Cape. So we came back, we've been here for like six days now and we're going to head to Port Hardy and um, if there's a window that opens up we may try to cross otherwise we'll just keep waiting um, they say don't rush it so we're trying not to do that but yeah we're leaving Port McNeil today for Port Hardy Alexander, we're hopefully going to be crossing Cape Caution tomorrow. We decided to go for it because uh, it actually looks like there might be a window, but if it gets too bad, we'll turn back like we did the other, like a week ago. I know, I can see it. Man, it 
it is so, so nice today. What? It is so nice today. Distracted. Yeah, apparently you just don't remember how to use the damn thing anymore. Oh, 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 the dog, this is the first dinghy landing we've had. This is. Oh, I'm this so season. Beach landing, yeah. Well, oh, I heard flip flop gang. Go uh, Dean, hold on. It's not far. I didn't have children to get my feet wet, that's for sure. <laughs> I think I took it off while we were in. Yeah, wow, that little bit of wind we had just died in here. Yeah, it feels amazing. I didn't throw that away. It was in the dinghy. <laughs> Where are you going? Stay on the beach. There aren't bears on this island, are there? I think so. I'm not even funny. I don't think so. You guys see a bear just punch it right in the balls. Yeah. Dominant. Good thing we're only staying here for one night, so it won't get ruined for us. <laughs> oh, by bad weather? Yeah. <laughs> I think it was your bowl. Honey, no, we're not bringing stuff to the boat. Uh, I got a boat, though. Yeah? Oh. Sorry. Ooh, ocean. What? Tell them about the nibblers, little guys. Tell them about the you nibblers. Too. Go ahead. Okay. They're little. They're they're stick. Uh, hold on. Wait. Oh, they're they're free spine sticklebacks. Acts nibbling on on the top of the water. Lance called one of them nibbles. They, they they're nibbling the water, and we can see the little waves. Now you tell them about nibbles. And this is Stephanie. And this is Tony. like comment and share this video it really does help push our videos and of course subscribe and thank you guys so much for watching our videos we do really appreciate it